On the day of Pope Francis's arrival in Seoul last week, last Thursday in fact, North Korea test-fired five short-range rockets into the East Sea. Now, new analysis suggests that they were in fact a new type of tactical missile that could potentially reach deep into South Korean territory. Our Kim Minji has the details. North Korea is believed to have developed a new form of tactical missile that could pose a new threat on the Korean peninsula. According to joint analysis by South Korea and the United States, the North has fired five of the new rockets last Thursday into the East Sea. A source within South Korea's Joint Chiefs of Staff says a new model appears to be different from the North's existing KN-02 missiles, or those fired from the 300mm rocket launcher, but maintains their advantages with a range of 200 kilometers and a warhead weight of 500 kilograms. The source said the new rocket, likely to be called the KN-10, is believed to use solid fuel and can be launched from a movable launcher. If fired from the military demarcation line separating the north and south, it could reach the central parts of South Korea. It can load many more explosives. It is a threat because it does not require advanced preparation to launch and can be fired at any time. North Korean leader Kim Jong-un is also believed to have purchased a new personal plane. Made in Ukraine, the Antonov 148 can seat up to 80 people, and unlike his previous plane, which was fitted with tables, this one looks more like a regular passenger jet. The plane, worth some 30 million U.S. dollars, shows Kim Jong-un's penchant for not just spending, but for traveling by air, unlike his father, who was notoriously afraid of flying. Kim Min-ji, Arirang News.